Hey, what's up everyone? I'm in front of the SMX3100 and that was a pretty crazy toolpath, wasn't it? What I've got going on is a swarf path from Mastercam. I'm simultaneously using the chuck as a C-axis, which moves along the toolpath. I've got the milling tool head, which moves in X, Z, and Y, and then also in B, puts it at different angles, and these run at the exact same time. It puts a clean chamfer, and you don't gotta do a lot of passes like you would for ball tracking. It's the quickest and most clean way to put a chamfer when you have all kinds of crazy 3D contours around your part. You can see it's pretty nuts how close it gets to the material. Of course, I ran it slow to make sure that it would clear, but Mastercam also told me that that tool was gonna clear. So because of that, I knew what to watch out for when I set this part up. This is just one tool path in this crazy part that I'm gonna be walking you through, both machining and we're gonna go over a little bit of programming in Mastercam. Make sure you check that out and stay tuned because you're not gonna to wanna to miss this.